welcome to another video. So today I will show you how you can use Python to detect human front and face. So uh, we will be using OpenCV for this and the technique or the method which is used here is the high cascade feature. So it is a machine learning based approach where the cascade functions they are trained using positive images and negative images and then this is used to detect objects in other images. So today we will work on face detection and hard features actually include your line features, edge features, your four rectangle feature on this. So uh, we will first detect faces in an image, then we will try the gang edge detection on the same image which is an edge detection operator that uses multi-stage algorithm to detect wide range of edges in an image. So it changes the edges into white and the rest is in black. So we'll try to complete these two tasks in this video. Before we start, please subscribe to my channel to get updates on my latest videos and like, share and comment as much as possible. So let's begin with the coding part. Okay, so let's start with the code. So go to file, new file. Then change plain text to Python. And then save this file. Okay, so now let's start with the code. Okay, so first you need to import the CV2 library. Now after this we are initializing a variable face cascade which will be equal to cv2 dot cascade classifier and then inside this you will have to place the file which we will be using so we will be using hard cascade frontal face default dot xml so hard cascade frontal face default dot xml now after this we are initializing a variable image which will read our image so you can use im read function for this and then inside this you will just have to write the file name so let's like this then to change this image into gray i'm again initializing a variable which is gray and then you have to write cvt color and then inside it first of all you have to mention your image and then cv2 dot color and then we will write bg r2 gray so this will change the color image to gray then face equal to face cascade dot detect multi scale and then inside this gray comma 1.1 so here 1.1 is by how many units how many pixels this box will shift while detecting the face and 4 here is for if it detects four faces then only it will be considered as a face otherwise it will not be okay now after this we'll apply the for loop for making a rectangle around the face so we are initializing four variables for the x y position and then w is for width and h is for height and these all are in face And then inside it, cv2 dot rectangle and 
and then inside this bracket you will first mention the image and then the parameters so x comma y and then so it's for the starting pixel and then the ending pixel so x and then plus the width and your y will be y plus h then you have to mention the color for the rectangle so I am just mentioning this and then to show the image you will use cv2 dot okay yeah so we will be using cv2 dot i am show and then again inside this we will just have to give a title so I am giving image and then the image variable and then we have to write cv2 dot weight key so that it the image will not suddenly disappear so we'll just save this and let's just try to run okay so this is the output so you can see that the faces have been recognized so there are four faces and the color is the same which we have given now let's move on to our second part okay so now what you need to do is you will just so you'll just have to write here can he equal to cv2 dot and then inside this you will just add the image and then 100 and 200 so these are your threshold values ok so after this you have to change this image to can now let's just save this and run this ok so now you can see that this has been changed to black and white and the edges are highlighted with white color so this is it for today and please like comment share and subscribe my channel if you like this so thank you